Hi, in this short video, I'm gonna show you how to blur text in Photoshop. Now, there's a number of different reasons you might wanna do this. You might have a form with some confidential information. Let's say, for example, this was a form with an email address, and you might wanna blur that out, but leave the rest of the information visible. Uh, or in some of the videos I've seen on YouTube, they're using a, uh, an image such as this and creating a transparent um, blurred effect, blurred like banner in the, in the middle of the image. Um, the videos that I've seen on YouTube, I'm just going to go over to YouTube. Some of these videos, in fact, most of the videos I've seen on YouTube um, either don't have someone speaking throughout the video. So don't ex they're not explaining what they're doing. It's just the cursor moving around the screen with some music playing in the background. Um, or they've got uh, tr some tutorials which really go into uh, probably far too much detail, really, to start talking about multiple layers and um turning some layers into uh, smart objects and all that kind of stuff and I've just sat, found a very very quick and easy way of doing this um, it, take, it took me quite a long time to figure this out uh, but it's going to save you a lot of time so let's say for example this form for, for to start off with so if we wanted to just blur this part here you can simply go over to this marquee tool and let's do a little rectangle around that okay and then simply go to filter go down to blur and Gaussian blur click on that and you can see here you can see like a preview and you can move this back and forth so that's obviously going to be um, increasing and decreasing the blurred effect so you want it maybe just about there uh, in this case it's just 8.7 it'll probably depend on on your own uh, image and then it's simple a case of basically just saving that and then that will save uh, save this image with the blurred effect to your computer uh, in this case you've got an image and if you wanted a blurred, transparent blurred effect in the middle of it, again, you could just go to that and do a rectangular uh, shape there, for example, and go to filter and go to blur, Gaussian blur. And again, you can see this here. So you can see that's blurred and you can see that's visible and you can blur it as much as you like. So I hope that's helped. Uh, like I say, it, uh, it took me a while. I was watching a number of different YouTube videos and they were going all into different layers and, and different effects and all that kind of stuff. Um, and it uh, it still didn't really help me. Uh, and I just found this very, very quick, simple way of doing it. So it's simply a case of just clicking on that and putting a box around the text that you want to hide. Go to Filter, Blur, Gaussian Blur. You see a preview just here. And you can just increase or decrease that. Okay. So I hope that's helped. Um, please feel free to leave a comment question um, below and if you like this video just feel free to like the video and subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss out on future videos like this okay thanks very much for watching and have a good day